Well, time to start another uh, vlogging day. It's 8 o'clock on August 6th, so this is the vlog for uh, Thursday, August, uh, August 6th. As you start breathing in and taking in the air when you're tired, the deep breath causes you to yawn. That's what this does with me. I've been looking for it for a while, but I just now found it. Is uh, Clay? I was at Clay Leia's channel, her main channel. Now she's got a vlogging channel, so uh, it looks like I'm going to binge, binge watch uh, uh, Clay Leia. I'll see how far back I'm going to go. I'll go to see how far back I want to choose it from. And then go from there. I went by the Good Bits. They had uh, an interesting video. It was from June actually, and they go up, up. They go on a lot of different. They go on these sort of tours, if you will, uh, road trips to different places. Like I guess you could call it sightseeing, but it they go to different restaurants, small small places. Um, out of the way place that you wouldn't necessarily wouldn't necessarily think of. So you get to see bits of uh, of of the country of where they are. I know f when I go out up north to the tiny village I go to every now and again. Uh, there are always these interesting town, small towns that have a variety. Of these, uh, they're a single owner shop in terms of a restaurant. They could have, uh, 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 you know, a gift shop attached to it. It's just very tiny and very quaint. And they have it done up in such a way that it, it's hard to find the same thing elsewhere. These sort of these hidden gems. The closest you can get to it was when uh, uh, the Food Network had this show, uh, Diners, Drivers, and Dies. And implying that some of these smaller restaurants may not look up to snuff. But they're in terms of the quality, but the quality is actually there because you're getting mom and pop type of food. You're getting, uh, in many cases, sometimes they're retired chefs or chefs who decide to quit the big city and go work in a small town. Other times, these are homemade recipes. They're, they're, it's stuff that you would not find in a standard restaurant. And I, the, the seeing these type of things, because I've experienced them myself, Sort of gives me an, uh, sort of an incentive to sort of fix up my kitchen, and I build a little tiny little restaurant and see what I can produce in there. And right now I've got a good way, an amazing way of producing bacon. Uh, uh, that gives me enough. I I'm gonna be. I had this. Just, I had just a little while ago. I had a bank of sandwich. I'm gonna have another one probably later on in the afternoon. But it, it didn't take me that long at all to uh, plop the bacon in the oven and and. Uh, Within 45 minutes, it was done. See, I don't like my bacon overdone. It can't be over. A lot of people burn their bacon. I don't like burnt bacon. My bacon has to have the right flexibility to it in terms of it can't be overdone, but it can't be underdone as well. And doing it in the oven gives you a lot of control, and you got to really nurse up the flavors when you're doing it in a slower fashion than than putting it in the frying pan or on the stove top. So that's the way I do my bacon anyways. So we'll see what happens tonight. Today I have to uh, uh, gonna finally get down to that final bit of editing. I cleared off enough space on my phone. I have to do more clean, clearing off on Friday. Uh, but we'll get to it when we get to it. And so now on with uh, uh, Clay Layla vlogs. And I should probably just pick a spot and then go. Well, when you have a hard time keeping your eyes open, that no, that means uh, the end of the, uh, it's an end of a segment where you have to go rest again, particularly if you're working on a 24-hour day and you just, what you do is you take rest breaks. And that's kind of the thing, it's 5 a.m. now at the, on uh, Friday, August 7th, and we're ending the vlog uh, uh, for, that began on Thursday. Uh, later than this time, we haven't gone a full 24 hours yet. 
I've got my editing base set up. I've got everything sort of organ reorganized again. I'm working on a new process that will make uh, editing the videos with uh, graphic overlays easier. It's a matter of getting through the process. I had to clear off a lot of, uh, uh, of space on the phone. I did that because uh, I'm using a phone or, or, or a device to do a lot of my work on. It's, it's become part of my office. I'll show you how my office actually works now. It's, it's, it's all on devices and that connects to a call a back-end network of Linux. <clears throat> and very much is it, it's it, uh, it's setting everything up so that I'm in the process of getting ready to go back to school in September where my new uh, research projects will start kicking off and I'll extend things out further. But as is, I'm still doing the upgrades, I'm still doing the repairs, I'm still uh, uh, organizing my notes, my, organizing my library. So a lot of times when you're doing library work, uh, you're bringing sources and you're bringing information in, and you just pile it up. It piles up, and so you have to every once in a while, when the piles get deep enough, go start digging through it and seeing how to file what you brought in. And that's kind of what I'm going through now. And I offload a, a fair amount of material. I still have more to do, but Right now, I'm just kind of feeling burnt out. I found Clay, Clay Leia's vlogs. She has, she has a regular main channel where she does things, does her videos, and then she has a vlogging channel. So I got that set up. Uh, I went by Yowie Vlogs. They had a video up. It's our life. It's our life didn't have anything uh, went by the Leroy's the Leroy's didn't have anything so I ended up at uh, our family nest and they had something uh, uh, leading into uh, Carly's 16th birthday from there I went to uh, uh, Femi 5 logs And I think I went to I went to uh, Clay Leia's after that. Finished finished up her vlogs, and from Clay Leia I went to Br just now I just finished up at Brawley Ann from Family Five vlogs, and that leads me to a point here where I am now falling asleep. That's uh, so why I was trying to turn things off because I can't keep my eyes open. This is what a burn looks like. This is what when you're starting to burn out. Uh, You've been going too hard, and you haven't had enough sleep. I mean, things are being getting done. It's, it's, it's not as if the, the progress is slow. But when you're fatigued like this, you definitely don't feel like you're worth it. And so, but anyways, I'm going to get some rest. And because the motto is we're going to keep going and no refunds. <laughs>